experience of all of this, you know, a couple months before the season starts? Uh, well, when I stepped on the field, I felt like I was at home, and I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, this stadium is amazing to play in, especially as a soccer player. And, uh, it doesn't get any better than this stadium and, and coming back to Houston. So thank you guys for coming out. I think we really felt the energy from the crowd. And hopefully you guys come back to the Dash games and we can do that every single time. We'll give you guys a show. All right, so we'll uh, we'll take a few questions from you guys. Uh, if you don't mind raising your hand and speaking loudly, and we'll, uh, we'll do this as affordably as possible. That's a good question. I think, I feel like you always have to be an optimistic person, regardless of your situation. Uh, for me, I always had the outlook of, you want to be in those person's shoes, and you obviously are really happy and proud for people who have success, uh, but you also get inspired by people like that. And for me, growing up, uh, I always kept that in mind, and every time I went out and trained, uh, it wasn't just the Olympics, but the World Cup, and, and players, you know, like Carly, I've been looking up to her, especially when I was younger and uh, growing up playing the game before I was on the national team. And so,
got and they connect they actually Blaine's got the the earbud put on the right and then it connects the morning. Yeah, we share. Uh, and we sing back and forth. That's one thing we do. And then I actually like to mix it up. I don't like to get the same routine because sometimes I have done that in the past and I feel like I'm going through the motions and I like to switch it up every time and and obviously when you're traveling so much, there's some things that you can't do all the time. And so I don't really want to get in the habit of making a superstition. You know, sometimes it might not go the way you want it to. But there's one thing I always do before a game. I jump three times. Peace to chess. <laughs> Uh, maybe because we have to go through so much in life. Um, and then men have a pretty easy answer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I, Megan and I have become really good friends. We're roommates a lot of time on the national team. And then I also live with her here, so I think I spent way more time with her than anyone else in my life for the past year. Uh, so we're, I'm a little sad that she's gone, obviously, uh, having her off the field and on the field. Uh, it'll be fun to play against her because she's so tenacious and, and fun to play against and, and with. I'm kind of upset that I have to play against her and not her home safety. Or... <laughs> I like my position. <laughs> Obviously, making the playoffs, and, and we're playing a good brand of soccer that a lot of people want to come out and watch. <laughs> 